If you want to know the best oils for making homemade lip oils, continue watching this video. The first oil is coconut oil, specifically liquid coconut oil. This is one of the top oils for making any type of lip product. It moisturizes lips, keeps lips soft, it absorbs quickly into lips, and provides moisture to heal and dry cra and cracked lips. Um, and it helps soothes and calms your lips or inflamed lips and this is a product that can be found literally anywhere So I highly recommend liquid coconut oil because it will definitely get you right and it's one of the best for Lip gloss lip oils lip balms all of that, but especially for lip oils. This is definitely one of the best oils to use Next is jojoba oil and this is a natural moisturizer. So if you want a natural lip oil, this will be like the oil that you will gravitate to the most. This jojoba oil forms a protective barrier over dry, dry lips and leaves them soft and smooth. Um, it's good for sensitive skin, it soothes lips and it protects lips from dryness and keeps them hydrated. So this is definitely one of the top oils for lip oils and it has a thicker consistency. Oils a more lip gloss type of texture if that's what you're into. The third oil is grapeseed oil and the reason why this is so amazing for lip oils is because it is lightweight and absorbs quickly. Um, what, it does, what it does for lips is condition lips, moisturizes lips, and keeps lips soft. It is also super moist, moisturizing and a powerhouse for essential vitamins and this oil will protect your lips from literally like so many things. So I would highly recommend this oil for lip oils if you want to have the best lip oil on the market. Fourth oil is applicant oil. This oil brightens, moisturizes, and nourishes skin. This oil is mainly used to brighten the um, skin tone or um, even out the skin tone on your lips with providing, you know, softness and radiance to the skin. So it is full of antioxidants and it has vitamin A, which is retinol and vitamin E. So it is good for like the fine lines around your lips. So this one is amazing if you want to even out or, you know, brighten or make the lips more pink. Um, so yeah, this is amazing for that. The fourth oil is castor oil. A lot of you might already use this oil or might know about it, but this oil is like on the thicker side and it helps treat dry and chapped lips and promotes hydration and moisturizes lips, heals lips and soothes lips. But the reason why I like this in lip oil so much is if you have a colored or a glitter lip oil, this will keep the like this will keep the glitter on longer and if you are using a flavor in a lip oil this will help keep it on longer so this is why i like this one for lip oils the fifth oil I'm going to be talking about is sweet almond oil and sweet almond oil is a lightweight oil that hydrates lips from within and locks in moisture. Of course, it um, helps soothe lips and helps moisturize lips. But also what I like about this one is that this oil does not leave a greasy residue at all. It is super lightweight. It's pretty affordable. So this is great for beginners. But yes, this does not leave greasy residue, which is why I love this one so much, especially in lip oils. The last oil I'm going to be talking about is vitamin E oil. This is overall just amazing. It moisturizes lips, keeps lips moisturized, and helps lips, helps chapped lips and hyperpigmentation on lips. Vitamin E oil has so many amazing benefits. It also provides aid in rejuvenating the skin cells and boosts circulation in preventing fine lines in your lips, which will just keep your lips very nice and, you know, plump and yeah all that great amazing stuff so this oil is amazing and i highly recommend vitamin e oil in your lip oils